So welcome to today's video. If you're new, I'm Georgia Kay. I am a first year history PhD student at Brown University and I film these sort of like day in my life, week in my life vlogs. In today's vlog, it's gonna be a fun one. We're kind of narrowing down on the rest of the semester. I literally only have one week left of my first year which honestly I've said this a lot but I am just like I, ca I cannot believe that it's already the end I'll definitely have like reflection videos I have tons of stuff planned but yeah today I have to go on campus I have a very long to-do list I have two very long papers final papers to write in two weeks so even though my last week of the classes this week we have like um an exam week so it will like stretch into that and I'll probably write I'll probably vlog that as well but I'm excited that you're here I think it's gonna be a fun one I actually just got ready I've been like filming clips all morning um but I just got ready for the first time just sort of like saying hi to the vlog and I'm gonna go to the Rockefeller library which is like my favorite sort of like study spot to find somewhere sit and get to tackling my to-do list <laughs> but I am starving. I skipped lunch, which was a mistake. I did bring a snack, but I was still really, really hungry. So I'm just gonna go home, see Harley, and then have dinner and then get finished on this. So I might be working a little bit late tonight because I just wanna get it done. I don't wanna prolong this longer than I need to. Vlog is literally, that is my very last day. So I can only say that for well today and technically the rest of reading period but it's insane to say that this vlog will be my final day as a first year at brown i am just like in shock i feel like i started vlogging the very first week of my first semester of my first year and now we're here the last day of first year which I just cannot wrap my head around, but I'm gonna take you guys along. Today's gonna be a fun one. I have two classes today and they're both my last classes for the semester. So we'll see what I get into, but I am just excited to share with you guys and also kind of sad that this year has gone by so fast. And honestly, I've loved it. Like I need to sit down and talk about it, but I know a lot of people hate their first year, especially for PhD, we tend to get a bad rep. And I know that it's definitely program specific, program specific but for me, I've had such a lovely, year so yeah i'll definitely talk about that later but i'm actually running a little bit late so i need to get to class okay okay so i'm not gonna lie i woke up this morning and i was really excited in my head about it being the last day but then i started to feel a little bit low energy and so i was just like not in the mood so i got ready kind of late and now i have like 10 minutes to get to class it's a good thing that the shuttle works fast sometimes so let's hope that it does today because i am running so late because i just was like dragging myself through getting ready today for some reason y'all i just said this in the bus i just turned the corner and the bus is right here love that for me love it so i will make it to class on time today
Okay, so I finished my last class earlier, like a few hours ago, and now I'm on my way to my second class, which is my official last class of the semester, and that's just crazy, but I'm on my way there now. I'm a little bit late because we're not actually doing any work, we're just doing a work session to work on our final paper, so it's a little bit more low stakes. And um, I actually have to work on sending an email to one of my professors and just thought about that but yeah I hung out with Grace and Haley we sat on the quad for a little bit talked and that was really nice so yeah so between my classes I had a few hours and I just hung out with Haley and Grace and we talked a little bit and so that was reflected on the end of the semester so good day so far great day actually <laughs> to my apartment and it is officially a wrap on my very first year as a PhD student. That's just absolutely, absolutely insane. I know I keep saying that, but honestly, I feel like the semester ended pretty much identical to last semester in a very eerie way. Like we ended it, we had snacks in class, the professor brought food for us, which is extremely, extremely nice. And then we all just sat, we talked. Um, she actually helps me figure out some ideas for my final project, which is like 40% of our grade. So that was definitely helpful. And then I just walked back and it was beautiful. And it just feels like a great way to end the semester. I am definitely, definitely looking forward to the summer. But of course I am a little bit sad because it's like, I looked forward to this first year so much and I feel like it went really well, went really smooth, of course. I'm gonna sit down and talk about my thoughts, the pros and cons. I'll definitely do a video also on Q and A's about Brown, like finding housing, what's the social life like and all of those things. But definitely I wanna reflect on my personal year and I just feel like I've had so much growth. I don't know if you guys have been able to see that in these videos because I have like tapered on and off of vlogging, but for the most part I have sort of like bookended my first day and my very last day. And it's just like, I feel so much more like an adult even though i wasn't really expecting that but just like living on my own paying rent and having a dog and everything i thought maybe because i was in grad school i would feel like i was in college still and i think this year has been making me realize like graduate school is definitely different than college even though it seems like just a natural continuation it there is a difference and i appreciate that difference because it's been able it's let me sort of form my identity outside of brown even though for the most part, obviously, I'm still like a graduate student, so I still have a lot to do with Brown, but I've been able to like go out with my boyfriend or just hang out with friends and just sort of like have a life that's more so in Providence and then I go to Brown as opposed to having all of my social life in the Brown area. So yeah, so I think I'm gonna make some dinner. I have some stuff from Trader Joe's in the fridge because I don't feel like cooking. It's literally seven o'clock. I am not gonna cook. And I'm gonna have that for dinner, watch some Seinfeld probably, and call it a night.